Hey guys, what's going on? This is Honest Abe checking in today. Uh, I was going to do a video on Tennessee recruiting today, but uh, I just decided it wasn't uh, really appropriate with everything um, that happened yesterday in Parkland, Florida. Uh, my uh, thoughts and prayers uh, go out to the families uh, at, uh, at Marjorie uh, Stoneman Douglas uh, High School there in Parkland, Florida. And... Um, definitely uh, be praying for you guys but yesterday uh, we were there was a school shooting at the high school in Parkland Florida uh, where the gunman uh, mr. Cruz he killed 17 uh, people and injured 14 others and uh, today the uh, the county police down there they released the names of, of all the victims uh, that, that passed away uh, a couple of them there was a football coach and athletic director and several students um, and I'm not I'm not going to list off the names I just I don't think that's appropriate on this platform um, of media but um, I just I, I wanted to to talk a little bit about this uh, really uh, there's just words just can't describe just the tragedy that happened uh, yesterday but I know that there have been many school shootings um, over the past uh, several years, I, I remember uh, Columbine happening back when I was uh, in high school, and that was that was crazy. And of course, we've had we've had several. I think I think CNN put out a report. There's been something over like almost 400 school shootings since 2013, uh, which is a lot. And of course, there was one in Kentucky just a couple of weeks ago that I, I brought to you guys just another brief. Um, little snippet on but um, this is one thing that seems to be happening in a lot and I know that a lot of people after a tragedy like this happens uh, they immediately start calling for gun control and all this kind of crazy stuff and people just you know start going crazy over it and, and you know this is really not not the time uh, for that you know our, our thoughts and our prayers need to be going out to these families and students and teachers um, at the school and you know one of the things that you know that, that was reported today was that you know this kid basically that did the shooting he bought the gun legally uh, about a year ago and so he went through the proper channels and he purchased the weapon uh, himself and you know he he turned himself in and basically admitted to doing this and he's going to he is going to face justice um, for it. Um, I know that you know that's that's hard to think about, and you know what all might take place uh, with that. But uh, he is going to face the consequences of his actions, and and I'm not, and I'm not going to blame you know any of the victims or you know give excuses or for why uh, Cruz did what he did yesterday. Um, but obviously he was hurting too. Um, and there was something going on there and, you know, and, and that seems to be the case a lot of times, um, for, for these shootings and, and it just, no words can really describe what, what takes place, um, during this time. And, and I know, you know, just here in East Tennessee, we had, we had the shooting just two years ago, um, at, at the recruiting office in Chattanooga and, you just saw a community come together uh, because of that, and and so yet yeah, there is there is some good that can come out of it, and I know that's hard to think about too during during a hard time like this. But you know, me personally, uh, I'm a believer uh, in Christ, and you know definitely uh, I believe that that even though through a bad circumstance i believe that god can work um and, and and make things good and who knows who knows what can happen uh through this and i just i i truly believe that that we we need to come together um as a people and in, in love and support not only this community right now uh but uh you know everybody just in general um we need to we need to show love to one another, and especially, I mean, it happened on Valentine's Day, so, I mean, it's, that's a day set aside that we're supposed to express, you know, our love and our care for, for one another, and and something like this happens, 
Um, so just my thoughts and prayers go out to uh, the community in Parkland, Florida. Definitely be uh, be thinking about you guys uh, the next next couple couple weeks, and you know maybe in the future I'll I'll talk more about this stuff. Um, and just kind of my thoughts on everything, which is going to be controversial and people are going to get upset, but hey, people are probably going to get upset because of this video right here. Um, but yeah, I'll probably, I'll probably uh, address this here in the future on, you know, just exactly my thoughts and everything about this. And again, uh, my thoughts and prayers go out to you guys in Parkland, Florida. I wish you guys the best. And this is Honest Aid uh, signing off for today. I hope you guys have a good day.